Hello and welcome to West Yorkshire Engine Services based in the UK. I'm an independent Nissan engine specialist and I've been specialising in the Nissan Navara and Nissan Pathfinder for over 10 years now. And trust me, there isn't anything that I haven't seen in that time. We have tried and tested every means and ways possible to try and save money on the repair of the Nissan Navara. Now, if you buy one of our timing chain kits for the duplex upgrade, which is the Nissan Navara Pathfinder and Frontera from 2005 up to 2015, we will also send you within the kit the vacuum pump upgrade kit and in this short video we're going to show you how to do the upgrade basically the shaft and the gear of your current vacuum pump is obviously single with with that faulty single timing chain and we need to change it to accept the duplex timing chain upgrade kit so how do we do it first of all under the terminals there's two pins there and there which I've just knocked out with a punch they must go back in so if you lose them let me know and I'll make sure we send you some in the kit they keep the unit sealed because obviously it's part of your brakes so it lifts off like that What we need to do now is push all them in and then carefully lift out the unit. Now it's absolutely imperative that inside of here is clean and that you get no grit or dirt in there. So you've got to give it a good clean and fresh oil when you reassemble. If the vacuum pump it doesn't look like that or, any, or if it started corroding or you find scratches, scrap it and get another vacuum pump. We're selling vacuum pumps worldwide so that ain't a problem. If you need a housing that's absolutely fine. But what will happen is if you find grooves or scratches in there, it, it just basically doesn't give the correct um, pressure to the brakes. Right, so what we need to do now is we need to change the shaft and gear. It's exactly three outside. There you go. And that just lifts off like that. Now we need to knock out the shaft. Now to knock the shaft out, don't use a metal hammer like that. The reason for that is, I'm gonna save you some money. This is the bolt that we've just taken off. What you need to do is screw it back on. And we're using that now, so not, not damaging the shaft or the thread. And we're going to knock it out that way. There you go. So what am I going to do with that now? Well, I'm going to bang that on eBay, get some money back off the timing chain kit. Um, because there's going to be plenty of customers out there that can't afford the upgrade kit, but need the balance shaft gear. Because not all timing chain kits come with the balance shaft gear and the shaft. So that'll help somebody else out in the future. What we want to do now is install the upgrade kit. Right, the end of this shaft sits in there like that and must turn perfectly. Do not, whatever you do, hit this end with a metal hammer. Yeah, you either need to do it with a piece of wood or a plastic hammer so you don't damage the end of there. If you damage it, you've just scrapped it. It won't work, it won't go in there. So it's simple as that, so you need to be careful on what you're doing. 
All you need to do, over the back, put your new shaft in, and tap it. Simple as that. We got there and end. Put the nut back on. That bolt, 41 newton meters. So tighten it to 41 newton meters. So you need to reinstall this, like I say, make sure that you don't get any dirt or grit in there. And what you need to do is you need to fan everything out. As you can see, you have a look there, this is, that's ovalised and it goes in a particular way. Slight bit of movement and it won't let you fit. Me quite fiddly. That one keeps moving. Take a few attempts, as you can tell. There we go. There you go. Can you see? So, you took fit your three 10 mil bolts. Now, it's absolutely imperative that you get these back in there. These keep this unit sealed. Make sure you do it nice and straight, otherwise you'll easily break the casting. See that there? Use a punch, send it all the way down. There we go. And final test. That's what your back punch sound sound like. That's working and perfectly. So I'm going to fit that to the engine now. And now the customer's got an engine which is running on duplex timing chain upgrade, which basically is absolutely fantastic for him. Right, now, over the coming weeks, we're going to be releasing a number of videos, so regardless of what problem that you've got with your Nissan Navara, whatever symptoms that you've got, just Google how to Nissan Navara, and you'll get a video of us showing you exactly how to do it. So subscribe to our channel, and come again.